Hello students, today we are going to learn phase solubility limit and unary phase diagram. Now first of all, what is phase? Now phase, it is a homogeneous portion of a system that has uniform physical and chemical properties. For example, water. If you put a water in a glass and whether at the bottom, in the middle or top, that water has the same physical and chemical properties so we can say it is a single phase is there and you can see also that water can have different phases it can be in the liquid phase it can be in solid phase it can be in the gas phase so there here so that phase means that is uniformity homogeneous solid solution is there next is the solubility limit so here in the diagram you can see solubility limit so this uh, here we can see so that what first of all what is the solubility is there it is the maximum concentration of a solute atom that may dissolve in a solvent to form a solid solution so here solute is a sugar and solvent is a water so once you put a sugar in a water and that if you thoroughly mix it and the sugar will not uh, appear and it will get fully absorbed in a water so if you keep on adding a sugar so the limit will come when the no more sugar can be dissolved in a water so that is a solubility limit now this is with reference to the figure here you can see here so this diagram at the bottom that what the percentage of the sugar is there 20 40 60 up to 100 and on the y-axis this is a temperature is there now here we can see that this is the maximum percentage of sugar which can be dissolved in water is about some 62 percent is there so after that then even if if we are adding sugar that will remain as a solid particles but and this red line is the solubility limit but if we increase the temperature still you can add more sugar so it means the solubility limit also increase with the increase in the temperature so this is the solubility limit is there with the example of a sugar in a water now next is unary phase diagram now unary phase diagram is a unary means single component so here we are taking for the water as a single element is there so this is a pressure temperature diagram for water so this i am showing in a in last okay now here you can see this is the uh, unary phase diagram for water the, this side is a solid phase is there this is the liquid phase is there and right side this is the gas phase is there so here you can see so and this top uh, the bottom x axis as a temperature and y axis as a pressure is there so at a certain temperature as the temperature is increased so whatever the solid that is ice is there so that melt it becomes liquid and again with increase in temperature that becomes again gases form that is a steam formation is there so this is the what we can observe so the water has a three uh, phases depending upon the temperature and pressure combination is there now here further we can uh, see this uh, diagram with respect to other features here we can see uh, this is uh, that blue uh, line you can see so uh, this is the center liquid phase is there right side gases phase is there and the left of this uh, green is the solid phase is there and this curve so this curve is there and from here when it is a heating temperature increase so this is a, again it convert during heating it becomes liquid and during cooling and it again come back to the solid stage is there so that is a uh, freezing uh, fusion curve is there and this side during again further heating it becomes vapors that is a steam formation is there that is a vaporization curve is there and this is the red 
curve is there this is a directly uh, that uh, solid ice convert uh, into a gases form that is sublimation uh, curve is there so all these three curves meeting at a single point this is called as a triple point so this triple point is very important so at this stage where all the phases solid phase liquid phases and vapor phase coexist at this and this is a corresponding to a particular temperature so here the temperature is mentioned here also so this is 0 0.01 degree centigrade and 0 0.006 atmospheric pressure the triple point for the water here the direct sublimation is there there is no uh, change into liquid the directly solid can be converted into a vapor form and here further you can see this blue line is terminating at a one point this is called as a critical point so this critical point also is that uh, the point above which so where there is a no uh, separation between liquid phase and the gases phase so and both liquid and the gases phase coexist so this at this point that is a temperature is 374.4 degree centigrade and 217.5 atmospheric pressure so at this it directly convert into a vapor forms so this is all about the uh, unary phase diagram for the um, water as a element so so with this we have uh, learned what uh, phase is there what is the solubility limit and what is the unary phase diagram thank you